walked in, I said um, that I think I'm going to get high off of the creative juices in this place. Part of what we're doing is the interview is a simulation. But another part of what I care about a lot is synthesizing all that is into something that's relatable for people. What I've come up with is something that I think right now is temporarily called seed theory. And every human is the same in terms of us being a seed, but the DNA inside of the seed is different. Each one of us has a different DNA inside of the seed, that tiny little bit that's different. And so that unique DNA is the way that we're gonna express ourselves fully into the world. And so here is a strange um, X and Y axis that I'll explore, <laughs> that I'll explain in a little bit, but just the general idea, I guess, is that X, the X axis is time, so this is when you're born, and this is like age 80, let's say, over here. And the y-axis can be something like the amount of actualization that you have. The amount that your seed's DNA has been fully expressed. This seed has roots on this side, and it has branches and leaves ah. on this side. On the, on the root side of things, you need nutrients. Every seed needs nutrients. You need love and compassion. You need air, water. On the nutrient side, yes, so you need all those nutrients. If any of those nutrients are missing, one of the things that happens is that the seed can get trauma. And if the seed gets trauma, then the seed has potentially can not have its maximal yeah. actualization. So, Did your seed have trauma? I wonder, I wonder who seed, you know, doesn't have at least a little bit of, of trauma, right? Um, if you do get a maximum amount of nutrients, let's say, for the seed, you have a higher propensity to rocket yourself up this way. If you maybe don't have the nutrients, you can accidentally rocket yourself this way. This is why in so many situations we see here on Stevenson Street, where our studio is, Marketing 7-ish, in the back alley Stevenson Street, there's so many humans that have had deep trauma. Yeah.